Go. We're going to Vegas, DJs. How long did that take? How many hours did that scene take? It. That was the first shot. That was the first take. <laughs> well, the preparation for that. Look at that sweatshirt. Huh? Red, Redbubble.com, people. That's right. Anyway, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. We'll see you next year in Vegas. Well, let's get the hell out no, of here. No, literally, we'll be there. Well, we'll be leaving Vegas on the 1st, but technically we'll be in Vegas next year. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Deuces. <laughs>
come join us. Join us. Shall, Shall you? <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy. How is it? Delicioso. Awesome. Which means delicious in Spanish. Very good. Good job in and out. It's not crowded. We're on our own space away from people. Perfect. And it's what? Brisk? Mm -hmm. Outside? It's pretty brisk. Mm. After this, we're going to go hit up uh, Starbucks. Mm. I need some fuel. You know what I mean? <laughs> that right uh, foot over there. That lead foot that she's got. It's feeling a bit heavy There's there a brick now. On that? Yeah. I don't know if your cat getting it, but anyway. Yeah, so we're gonna pick up some gift cards from Starbucks. because um, we usually bring bring uh, Jonathan Jossel, Lisa Melmid, some of the other staff. Yeah, you know, a little something something. And Richard. And Richard Wilk, yes. Alright, bon appetit. Bon appetito. Oh god. Here we go. As this soon is as the, the camera was in my way, I couldn't see it. This is a di Oh! Blame the camera. This is the scary part of the trip. Talk about gambling. This is gambling with your life. <laughs> you're, with that you're one. An ass. You with that are one. An this ass. is the worst. This is the most I gamble on these trips. Is riding in this seat. Whoa. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Nice and easy. Yeah, it should be. Wait till the Starbucks kicks in. Then we'll see how she drives. <laughs> Uh, damn it. I'm gonna drive perfect. Oh! <laughs> what, what happened? The light turned. I'm gonna drive the light perfect. Turned Boom! No. The light turned green on them. So I'm, I, I stopped and then I was gonna go and then. Yeah. Longhorn Paranormal. Haunted for. Haunted or Hex? Oh, wow. Interesting. What does that mean? Follow them! Let's find the spirits! I got my ghost detector in the back. <laughs> he does. Yep. Haunted or hex? Or hoax. Oh, that Haunted makes sense or now. Hoax. Now that makes sense. I say hoax. I say haunted. This ain't no jokes. It's gotta be a hoax. You're so stupid. <laughs> Pro tip when driving with two cent. Two things. Number one, make sure your insurance covers your liability. A long time ago when we rented our first vehicle, you said our insurance covers rentals. Uh -huh. Is that true? Number two, <laughs> you gotta have one of these things in the car to hold on to. This is very important. There's a lot of G-forces and G-turns that are made. <laughs> you're, you're just jealous because I've, I've never gotten into like, a major so accident. Lucky. The, <laughs> you're not lucky at slots. You're lucky in the fact that you haven't been hit. Whatever. <laughs> Here's the MTV Cribs version of our van. Here we have the the kitchen uh, area. Pantry. 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 Entertainment. Entertainment. Uh, dining room slash yeah. Then we have the uh, the lounge, the parlor slash closet. Closet. And if you go back here, we've got the bedroom <laughs> right here, the bed boudoir. And right behind that, the most important is the garage. 
This is a garage. Uh, well, we got the bikes. Tell them how you took a seat out. Oh, I took a seat out, all right. And it's sitting in our actual. Garage. I don't know what that means. Yeah, so I took one of the rows out, half of a row out, and put it in our garage at home. And now we got the bikes in there. And that is a tour of our van while we're on this ginormous line in Starbucks. So it's going to take us a little bit longer to get to Vegas. It's a ridiculous line. Because someone needs. And when you need, that's an addiction. I was willing to just wait the extra hour it would take us to get to Phoenix. And then do this again, I'm sure. This is probably the only Starbucks in this town. That's probably why there's a long ass line. Go ahead then. But go. you know what though? It probably still is my fault because I set the alarm for one and I don't remember shutting it off. Uh -huh. This one wakes me up at like 2.30. Because she can't put the alarm on the time that she actually wants to get up, which is the problem. Put it on the time that you want to wake up and then wake up. That's stop, it, a stop. novel idea. She has to put it an hour ahead. She has to change the time 15 minutes ahead so that she feels like she got an extra. Some Just get people, up. Some people can't spring out of bed like you. See that? Stop. See how I can do that? Ah! I'm you doing my exercise. Will you sit down? I'm doing my lunges. Oh, <laughs> you little jerk. That's a messed up. she starts winning. It would have been worse if I had remembered to take my um, apple cider uh, vinegar gummy. But I didn't. Like I said, five days from now, when she finally does a number two, that's when you'll see the winds come. <laughs> the, the jackpot. Yep. Start Count it. Oh god. Oh, I guess we're not stopping it.
we're doing? Uh, no. But we're gonna have to think of some place to eat. Yeah, Maybe pick something Saginaw's. up. Saginaw's. Alright. Yeah, I mean, we're gonna try it, right? Yeah. We're gonna be there, we're gonna make a night out of it. Alright. I wanted some, some Christmas time with this one. Believe it or not. No matter how angry he Proper. makes me. Checking in, this goddamn bag is like 50 pounds of battery. Horrible. But uh, yeah, that background changed. So here we go, we're gonna check in and see how this room is. We'll see you in the room. There better be a bottle of Dom and some freebies in there. All right, so it got real fancy. I got my Moscato. <laughs> Matrix, this is for you, buddy. It's not a Moscato. It's, Moscato. it's champagne. She had a little bottle. Shh, that's nice. That's a nice touch. All right. Is it good? Mm -hmm. All right. behind that our room is not ready yet uh, it is five o'clock a little after five um, but we'll explain a little bit more further when we're in the room yeah. so we decided to come to Saginaw's the guy that looks like Penny his deli Jewish deli love the ceiling there um, just for a bite and then uh, hopefully We'll see when the room is ready. We'll find out. They'll give us a call. Sandwich looks good, bro. What did we get? Pastrami on rye. Yeah, with the mustard. Yep. That's it. Simple. And a little pickle on the side. 
We went simple. I like it. It looks great. It's a good size, everything. Just haven't tasted it yet, though. You know how we do. Let's see how this is. Mm. Yeah. It's good. The rye bread is really, really fresh tasting. It's already mustard on it? Yeah. Warm meat. That's a lot of meat. That's good. I think this is too much meat for me to handle. It is. You're not used to that. So we found out this Russian sauce right here. House made. House made has anchovies in it. I wouldn't have known. It's good. I like it. I'm gonna put it all up in my sandwich. Okay, we don't want to. You don't want to? <laughs> I know how that is. Okay, so okay, we're eating at Saginaw's and we ran into two awesome people. They noticed us. Well, we they, don't fit in very well here. They, 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 they spotted us, and so we're not used to being spotted yet. Like we're still very new to us. But yeah, it's Jimmy and. Tamara. Jimmy and Tamara, <laughs> so good to meet you guys. Nice to really, really yeah. nice people. Yeah. We love except, meeting people. Like yeah. this is like a I big part of why we do it. He's like, let's say hi. I'm like, no, that's awkward. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> You'll see this like five months from now, probably. Yeah, in five months. <laughs> yeah. Not people not are gonna say, you guys never age. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mentioned it took two hours we got here at 4 30 um we our room wasn't ready so i booked a king single king strip view room for october for december 28th and 29th for two nights um it was a total of 720 something dollars plus resort fees and taxes so I, I, I'm paying around 800, 820 bucks more or less for two nights. I booked it back in October. November, I get a call from the concierge and he says, hey, how would you like to check in on the 26th? And I'm like, mm, isn't Circa opening on the 28th? They said, yes, but we're hosting the world's earliest check-in. Ah, okay, so I told them the rooms are already ready then. They're gonna be ready early. He said, yeah. I'm like, is there any extra charge? He said, no, free on us. So we jumped on the on the chance to stay here four nights to kind of lessen the blow of the cost. So it turned out to be like a hundred something a night versus 200 something a night, I think, or no, it was like 300 something a night. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was like 330, $360 a night. So anyway, we get two extra free nights. We get here and they said, I was like, we have a pool uh, strip view, right? And the lady at the desk said, oh, those rooms aren't ready yet. Those, those aren't gonna be ready until the 28th. And I'm like, okay, but we paid for a strip view. And they basically explained, not all the floors are open. Yeah. So the higher floors are not open yet. And so I'm, I'm guessing this is as high as they could put us. But again, it wasn't ready, so they had to probably figure out they got this strip view let's put them in the highest floor we can possibly put them even though it's in between the pool and the actual strip view yeah we it's like quasi strip view like i said like i can't see this actual strip i could see around the strip i could see on top i could see on off strip sides but i can't see the strip and that's why i, I wanted to pay a little extra uh, this is our christmas gift for ourselves I came back with some extra money from our last trip and I said, you know what? This is our Christmas present. We're gonna screw it. We missed the, the casino opening on the on October 28th. So we so said, let's do the, the hotel opening. And um, I told her, okay, well, are you gonna then book us in whatever you have now 
and then on the 28th change our room to what we what we booked and I guess they didn't want to deal with that or something uh, I mean I guess I, I could say they did go out of their way to kind of get us something but I'm gonna say I shouldn't be paying $20 extra because that's for a strip view and I don't have a strip view a pool view is $20 less um, I would settle for paying maybe take get take ten dollars off each night that's only 20 bucks but yeah but we we checked online and the the rooms for this week are starting at nine hundred and ninety nine dollars for a for a base room um, let me show you something all right so I put in the dates December 28th check out uh, I know you can't see that uh, Wednesday the 30th which is what we initially booked starting rate $999 per night okay granted this is a last minute price and it's New Year's Eve week right but the room we have single king strip view is starting at a thousand, I know you can't really see that, a thousand thirty nine dollars per night. So, yes, we're paying way less than that. I guess these are last minute prices, they're extremely crazy pricing prices. Um, makes me want to drink. You know, if you stay at the D, you get free parking, you stay here. On top of what you're paying, you still have to pay for parking. And it's how much per day? $25. $25 per day. Even if you're staying here and paying an outrageous amount. Unless you valet it for seven. You can get it. If you do valet every night you hear that's $7. But guess what? That's time away from your schedule. And we are busy people. And you, you know us, guys. We're all over the place. To have to wait... Uh, to get our, our, our van and then we don't know if we could just walk in there and be like, hey, where'd you got, where'd you park our van? We just need to get our bikes out. I think we get these glasses, right? Yeah, I think we keep them. That's cool too. I just thought of that. That's worth $25. I don't drink. Oh. I don't benefit from this. Champagne. Champagne dreams and caviar. Champagne. Wait. Champagne. 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 Caviar wishes? Champagne oh. dreams and caviar wishes or something like that. Here's to you, Robin Leach. You don't even like caviar. You want me to pour you some? I'll eat the caviar things? and you can have the... No, I don't drink. I know, but I'll pour it for myself. And then I... No, uh, I want my, my glass to remain pristine. So guys, yeah, let us know in the chat. I mean, in the comments. Let us know in the comments what you think. Your initial first thoughts yeah. of the what room. Would you pay, what would you pay for this What room? would you pay for this room? <laughs> and I know this... <laughs> you're going to have to cut that out. This might seem trivial to you guys, but paying 300 something a night and that fridge is not where it's supposed to be? <laughs> my OCD, that... No. I know that's stupid and I know that shouldn't matter. But you know what, guys? There's a reason why there's vents in that closet, right? Yeah. So where does the heat go? Well, now it's going... Now it's going into the there. carpet. Yeah. Sorry. No, we're just going to burn down? No, it's not going to burn. Well, I'm sure they thought that through. I'm drinking from the bottle. This is We've a never different had view. this vantage. Yeah, this is ever. a different view for us, for sure. Nobody has, literally, from this room. Oh God, I could step on the ledge and I feel like I'm falling. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. I could see El Cortez from down here. Can you? Oh yeah, yeah I see it. Four queens. Yeah, look guys, I'm like stepping on the... That's cool. I know this is terrible lighting. We are the first people in the entire world to, to stay in, in room 3127 at Circa. So that's pretty cool. Um, I, I don't think anybody's had a view looking down at Oscars since the Las Vegas Club was 
here yeah. and open way back in the day. Looking down on the plaza ever. Yeah. We're above it pretty much. Well, I mean, you have Golden Nugget across the way. <laughs> they have the same view, oh, actually. Sh- <laughs> so Are you scratch sure? Scratch that. Yeah. I think we're no. a little bit higher. Scratch that. <laughs> Shit. Well, from this angle. Okay, from this angle. And we can watch games for free right here. We yeah, don't get but we don't. Oh, that's right. We don't watch sports. But room tour. This is more like vlog part now. Vlog part. It's like a mirror. <laughs> yeah. So we just did a live stream from the room. And it was fun seeing everybody in there that, you know, the family, yeah. the couch crew. It was really hard keeping this a secret, you guys. Um, but yeah, well, we had fun and we totally appreciate everybody that came on on a Saturday night. Yeah. So um, now it's yeah. 9.30, 10 ish. We're gonna go play if we can. I doubt there's gonna be a good card game to play right now for us, but we're gonna see just for the heck of it. Oh, look at that. We're gonna there you go, Corey Crow. Roulette. Roulette. So we're gonna see if there's some free bet. But, uh, tables open. We've gotta see what the minimum is. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, so here's our report. Saturday night, multiple $10 games here. We were playing a double deck game on a Saturday. El Cortez, you're not gonna find that. Three to two, you're not gonna find that anywhere else. So that was pretty good. Uh, I call that a win. And I probably would have still kept playing, but I decided to do a little bomb at the end and I threw down a big hand. That's right. I lost. Okay, so now we're gonna just scope out the scene at the plaza. We want to know if there's a certain game there, slot game, and then uh, call it a night. There we go again. So this is what's become of the party pit, I guess. But it's it's true. This is Wheel of Fortune Central. Wow. A whole bank of them. Did you hand sanitize your hands before you yes, touch your Yes, you took 
in. Here's hand sanitizer. I didn't see you, so I'm asking. Smell them. Oh Lord in heaven, I need a guy's trip. Quick. Break and bake it. We're gonna low roll 88 cents. We're down 50 for the night. We? Well, I'm down, <laughs> I'm down 50. Two cents down, two hondos. That was quick. And the, the, the machine's trying to tell her something. There. Uh, didn't want to accept her card. It did now. Come on, Plaza. Don't be rude to us. All right, I'll let you know if I hit anything. Okay, so two cents got a feature. What do we go with? I'm going to go with a 15. 15. Oh, 
Just a line hit. Michael. This is bad. Look guys, we have a Bruno cam. I don't know if you can see that, but Bruno, he's right over here. He's asleep. Aww. He's adorable. I miss. 88 cent spin. Boom, shaka. 48 bucks. Don't leave, leave that, that Tito, Tito in. in. Uh. What you know about that? Pennies. 88 cents. <laughs> $48. That is, oh, maybe 15 minutes of his bar tab. <laughs> Thanks, Peggy. We just want to see what happens when you blow up. Okay, though. so what does it say? 15 free spins, 43 ways to win. But 10 has that. And five. Let's try the five. All right. I mean, at this point, we're still up. We put 50 in. What could possibly go wrong with this? You win nothing. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least we get the free spins over with quicker and makes the vlog shorter. Oh, we got an extra row. Yeah. That's what it does. What is that? Two dollars. Okay. Well, oh, no. It's better than the 10, uh, better than the 15. That's about what I won with the 15. I mean, at least it's something. Three trigger. Oh, that would have been sweet if they moved over. Yeah. Oh well. Still, it comes out about the same. How's that? His piggy blew My up. My pig blew. So we're looking for no. Right. And if Zuck has anything to do with tonight, now, now is the time for a grand. The major is okay, but it would only piss me off because it's forty dollars. Yeah, over the damn hand pay rule. Oh, that's right. Well, not, I won't be sad at that. That's fine. It's still 900 bucks. If I get $12, I'm going to be very pissed. <laughs> well, let's see. Okay. Uh, no, thank you. you so, we've got to go with Z9 as our first. It has to be a first one, Z9. What is that? Mary Joss. Oh my god. Make this an epic trip. You know they call me ham pay hog, that's what they call me. But he's never won a damn ah, yeah. I know. Ah, ah. Just like he paid for this plaza jacket. I did I did not yes, pay for this. Did. This is free. Jonathan Jossel got on his knees and said, here. No, it. he did not. Take Please. that back. Jonathan oh, would never take do that. this. Jonathan has way more class. Come play pickleball with me. Okay. Hand pay hog, that's what they call me. So what do we do after Z9, the opposite one? Oh, no. That's not a good sign, Hauser. Now what? Now it goes right next to it. They can't be two diamonds. Two? This? I don't know. Mine out. I don't know, you, you pick your own. Well, big, big balls attract big balls, so maybe blue attracts blue? Oh, God. What is my oh, no, know? it doesn't. Yeah. You don't do that? No. It's already predetermined. We already know what it's fitting to do. That's the way. Uh huh. Oh! oh my That's God. what we need. <laughs> That's what we need. Where would another purple be hanging out? It's predetermined, so it doesn't matter where I touch. It already knows what it's gonna give me, right? Isn't that how it works? I guess. It doesn't matter where I touch, I don't think. So really. It doesn't matter if you touch this one, this one, or not. No. So I'm gonna go with this one. I would have got the mini. I would have picked one of those. Three. Yeah, but I think we still would have got the bloody mini. No matter what. Look, now it's down 
to ten dollars. Well, I should quit because what the hell? How much did you put in? I put in 50. Alright, let's put it down to 90. That's what I would do. That's uh, one more spin. Alright. Backup spin. Backup spin. And that's it. Cash it out. Oh, the lights are nice. The blue light special. Vapors. Everywhere you go, there's mist. Is that going to be a copyright song? No. How much you down now? Two sixty. <laughs> Two hundred and sixty dollars. Maybe all that now stuff is. Now you're about to lose your ass. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Trip's not over. Trip's not over. Nope. Once you do, drop a deuce. Five more nights. Five more nights. What could go wrong? <laughs> All right, day one in the bag. In the bag. It is 12.52. So it's almost one o'clock in the morning here. Which is early for us. Which is 2, 2 a.m. in El Paso, which is a time we pretty hours. much woke up at. Yeah. So we've been officially up for 24 hours. Yep. So we're exhausted. We're gonna shower. We're gonna go to bed. Um, so yeah, we spent most of our time doing our live stream from the room, uh, surprising everybody <laughs> that we were even here. Um, so it's not gonna be too much footage for today. Uh, Saginaw's, aside from the road trip here, Saginaw's. It's gonna be a normal vlog finally. <laughs> In length. Yeah. A bunch of B-roll. Very limited mm, talking. Uh -huh, <laughs> anyway, but yeah, so I look forward to a new day tomorrow, full day in Vegas, our first full yeah, day in Vegas. It's always nice to start fresh. Yeah, so the plan is uh, we're gonna take the bikes out. We're gonna just cruise all over downtown. We're gonna head over to the donut bar, um, have breakfast there, and then cruise around East Fremont, um, end up in the through Fremont area downtown and then maybe end up in the Arts District. Yep. I'm gonna try out um, Good Pie, um, opposite of Evil Pie. So we're gonna compare Good Pie with Evil Pie. Uh, so we'll probably eat at Evil Pie again sometime this trip, right? Yeah. Yeah, just I'm so we can do that. a good comparison. Yep. Um, uh, we saw um, Sleepless in Las Vegas and the other me tried Good Pie. Yes. And it looked good. <laughs> yeah. So check out their channels so, yeah, too for their... They told us to go check it out, so... Yeah, so check out their channels for their review on, yeah. on it, their comparison. So that's The Other Me and Sleepless in Las Vegas. If yep. you would be so kind to check awesome out their channels. Stuff they got. Yep. yep. We like them. They seem like really cool, genuine dudes, so... We met Richard downstairs. It was yeah. nice to see him. Busy as always. Yeah. Um... You know, opening day was opening day. It's never going to be, like, going off without a hitch. There's always a hitch um, when it's, you know, first night. Yeah, working out um, kinks. But, again, we are not complaining. We think there's value in what we booked. And, again, we're, like, Vegas history people. We like, you know, if we could have been there when they first auctioned off all this land, mm -hmm. <laughs> that would have been amazing. So... This but, is as close as we can get right now. So first one's to stay in this room. Yeah. Which is super stoked for that. Yeah. And I would do it all over again. I mean, with that, um, during our live stream, we did mention some cons. But we're just trying to be as transparent as we can. We're not going to paint a informative, rosy picture. We're just trying to be informative. We're not yeah. trying to bash anything. No, not at we're all. We're giving our information, what we experienced. Yeah. Take it how you want to take it. Yeah, yeah. So... I mean, we're human, right? Who, yeah. who would want to wait two hours to check into their room? <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's a lovely room. It is. And uh, I'm just happy. Yeah, we're the first ones to stay in this room. But anyway, um, it was a good first day. Yep. We'll see you guys all tomorrow. Deuces. Bye.